Thank you for coming back to Polka Dot Mailbox, and if you're new, welcome. Today I am doing a different kind of video for you guys. So every Monday, Polka Dot Mailbox posts a new deal of the week, and it's a bundle that I will create projects with throughout the week and show samples and videos, and I can't do that this week because this week is essentially a grab bag. It is a Maggie Holmes mystery bundle. So since I can't show you my mystery bundle, I am going to show you these grab bags. And you can't even see how many I have here. One, two, three, four, five bags and two boxes. The $4 grab bags from Michaels. So let's just get started. This one's in front of me, so I'll break into it. I am going to total up everything at the end and let you know the complete value of what was in the mystery grab bags. Oh wow, I see something I really like in there. <laughs> okay, uh, an entire set of the Shatterproof Christmas ornaments in gold, regular $45, is the first item uh, out of the bin. So we're off to a good start. This is the thing that caught my eye that is totally adorable. I love this. <laughs> it is so cute. Really cute. So it retails for $10 and it's just a little ornament, really pretty colors. I like that a lot. I see another ornament in here that's really very pretty. And it's like a material ornament but it's also $10, super cute. These would be like terrific to have as a gift topper, which is what I'm going to use them for. A phone ornament kit makes 12 regular $8, and it's to make ornaments that you can put little pictures in, or I guess you could even draw little faces or something on the inside. A cute little kid's craft for next Christmas. Mm. Mm. <laughs> okay. This is a good bag. Puffy stickers. So we have a couple of different kinds of these stickers. Some shaker stickers. I love that little cactus, the mermaid, the unicorn. Ooh. This one has two in the one. So they're each $5 Canadian. So there's $15 worth of stickers there. Oh, you guys see me work with this foam a lot. This would be good for adding dimension to products or um, to projects. So the kind of foam that I usually use is for Michaels and it has an adhesive back, but that will do the trick. Wow, you guys. Christmas tinsel garland, just plain gold. Again, I can see using this in crafting on a project. Not too much all at once, but yeah, I, I'm afraid I'm probably gonna get way too many of them. And the price on these guys, $4. So all the prices I'm gonna state are in Canadian. Just a little twig, sort of odd, $2.99. This is a good little stocking stuffer, $5. Oh, it has stickers. Oh my gosh, my daughter will love this. She'll be getting this next year. More of these shaky stickers. And this odd, I don't even know what these perler beads, melty bead kit. I do not know what that's supposed to be. <laughs> Whatever. It was in there. Oh, wow. Awesome. Cute little puppy again. Great to put on a little gift topper. More stickers. Yay. Again, these are $5 Canadian. Two of those. $6 for these adorable snowmen cookie cutters. 
I'm gonna run in a room. <laughs> Does anybody need garland? Because <laughs> this is just one bag and I bet you there's more of these to come. Oh, this is a cookie cutter that's a sweater. I think you can use it to make like an ugly sweater Christmas ornament. Bows, perfect for putting on like a gift basket. Okay, these excite me. Why are they wrapped up? Like what's so good in here? So you guys, I locked out. I just happened to notice an unboxing video. Oh wow, on YouTube yesterday saying, run to your Michaels. They might have the grab bags. So what I did was I went to, um, I called them and I asked them, do you guys have your grab bags? She said, not today, but we're putting them out tomorrow. So I went there today and I will tell you, minus 45 here in Canada today, unusually cold temperatures, minus 45. <laughs> so. I deserve my uh, good deals. Actually, it wasn't that bad. I walked my uh, daughter to school this morning and the dog, and it was fine. You dress for it, it really cold is cold. This is adorable. A little ice cream cart, cupcake cart, <laughs> like a little burrito. <laughs> okay, these are $14 and $16. These are glass ornaments. Let's put the breakable stuff on this side. Oh gosh, there's another one in here. And this is a little penguin. The price on this one is $4. Seems to be missing its beak. Okay. Continues. Wow, this goes on forever. Okay. We have a silicone mold bakeware. This shape is bells. This shape is llama. Bows. So, those would be great to uh, have as little gifts as well. Another bow. Ooh, another wrap. Something. Oh, wow. It's a little hot air balloon. Oh my god, that is so cute. It's 14. I don't even remember seeing these. It's $14 um, regular. I don't even remember seeing these at Michael's when they had their stuff on. Okay, fragile stuff because, like, what is this feathery thing? Oh, you guys. <laughs> it is a $14 swan. Oh, that is super cute. Oh, I like that. Wow. So something else in here. Oh. little dancer. Little ballerina shoes. $14 again. Keep in mind, everything you saw so far, I have paid $4 for. Huh, and this is great. Very different. $14. Almost looks like it's stone. Or pewter. On the non-breakable side. Okay. <laughs> letter E, the letter P, a light up, $9 each for those, okay, I'm running out of room, I'm only on the first package, foam stickers, Christmas trees, two packages of those, and they are 40 pieces, $5. Great for kids' Christmas crafts. Wood pine melts. I will not use those. Um, 
that will be something I donate. Oh my gosh, this is adorable. This little pick with the reindeer. That's really cute. Oh my God, there's another. Oh, this one wasn't wrapped up. They have two of these. $14. Oh, I cow, you guys. This was a good bag. This was like a really good bag. <laughs> Seriously. I'm going to end up with a ton of stuff. Okay. Another one of these. I didn't tell you the price of these candle melts. Uh, $5 Canadian. These are probably a mess. Oh, there's two of them. I won't even take these out of the bag. There's two. They're $9. We have no shortage of these in real life around here. And then, oh god, this bag never ends. Well, those smell nice. They smell like cinnamon. This is $9 for these fancy little ornaments. And they have a gold glitter or red glitter. Again, $9. Other package of those. A little bit different. Same colors, different designs. Oh, let it snow. Okay, this is adorable. Five dollars. I really like this little journal. It has stickers. That's super cute. And then this little snowflakes. That's great. My daughter loves snowflakes. Whoop. Another one of these picks that was $6.99. I didn't tell you the price of that. Honestly, like it's going to take me <laughs> a long time to add up all these. Another snowman, another um, sweater. Every year I actually work at our kids' school. We um, organize a Christmas store and we, oh my God, I just realized something. So every year we, we let the kids come and shop. So they can buy things for their parents without being with their parents and then we wrap them up and they take them home and put them under the tree and it's a true surprise and all the stuff is donated and then the money used raised um supports kids in the school so this year we bought food hampers for some of the less fortunate kids in our school with the two thousand dollars that we raised from this store this stuff like is going to come in so handy for for that store because like right here I'm looking at bag number two wrapping paper galore like like wrapping paper one two three four five this one's got gold and polka dots I'm keeping this one <laughs> actually all of these are ones that you could use outside of just Christmas. I think I'll keep some of the non-Christmas ones and then use the really Christmassy ones for the Christmas store that we run every year. This is just a plain red wrapping paper. <laughs> Valentine's Day, hello. <laughs> um, this one has stars and snowflakes on it. Like it's green, you could use it could use that for anything. Okay, so we're on to bag number two. I almost want to total up like each bag and see <laughs> what was in. Oh my goodness, like if I were to keep them separate. Let's see what was in each bag. I'm just gonna have to do a grand total. I spent $30, you guys, on all of the stuff um, for these bags that I have here. Okay, some more silicone molds with uh, llamas and little candy canes and candy, oh gosh, <laughs> another one, another one, so bows and bells, this one is wreaths, guys, this is amazing, okay, I'll put that over there, yeah, I totally, wasn't thinking about the Christmas store that I helped to organize every year when I was buying this stuff and I'm so glad that I got as many as I did. Okay, another <laughs> cookie cutter. Honestly, this stuff's, half of the stuff is getting donated to my Christmas store. These are amazing. 
These bows I didn't tell you originally, $4. Oh my gosh. Wind it up train. Stocking stuffers. This is a train that winds up. It has a little track. It has four tracks and a train. That is great. $5. Oh my gosh. So excited. Okay. <laughs> this basket is spectacular. $30 this basket was. And it's fantastic. I love the lining. I, yeah, that that might be my favorite thing in this mystery grab bag. More garland than I can ever possibly use. <laughs> okay. Four dollars, four dollars. Another one. Okay. I'll do a tally on how many there are in this bag. So this bag didn't seem to have as much stuff, but that gift basket was the best thing. This little um, snowman cookie cutter we've seen before. Oh, they do have prices on them. Three dollars. One, two, three, four, five, six of these in this bag to go with my stack. Again, honestly, we can use that in the gift wrap. Bows. Four dollars. Four dollars. Gosh, I could put a bow on, I don't know, every tree on the walk to school. I don't know. Well, this is a Christmas light and a little reindeer. Hope you guys can see everything okay. Three dollars each. And then two more of these nine dollar pine cones. Not in love with those things. They're messy and I hope they smell nice though. Yeah, they smell really nice. Okay, that's two bags down. I just realized that I didn't even talk about these. They were in the first bag or the second bag. Um, two gift baskets and they are regular $30 each. Well, $30 for that one. $20 for that one. Nice little set. Well made. A sturdy basket. And then a wreath mold. Again, the silicone bakeware. Okay, let's move this one over. Okay. This one was the first one as you walked in and you're facing the door. And Considering the price tag on the front of $140, which let's face it, is overpriced, but I was thinking this is probably a good bag to get. I do not know what this is. Some sort of like Christmas tree would be a nice decoration just to put out on the front steps, I'm guessing. A couple more bows in here. One, two, three of the four dollar bows. Add them to the pile. So that's exactly what it is. It's a little mini Christmas tree for four dollars. <laughs> Regular one forty, and then you can. It was sort of squished into the bag here. We could start decorating decorating it now with all the new ornaments that I got. <laughs> Except it seems to come with its own built-in already done ornaments. So that's what that guy looks like. So three bows and a $140 Christmas tree for $4. And we can 
definitely play with this and bring it back to life. Pretty it up. Yeah, that's that's great. Yeah, if you wanted to even have like a little Christmas tree in your office or camp or something like that. Or by our fireplace. It's right over there. <laughs> okay. This one <laughs> was a build your own grab bag. <laughs> so as I was making friends with the girl who worked there, and uh, she was giving me, you know, sort of like a brief, brief overview. I asked her, is there any things that have like paper craft stuff? She said, well, this one might have stickers or whatever. And as I was making friends with her, she came back to me and she said, oh, come over here. Because we just discovered a whole shelf of things of the Christmas crafts. These are the foam sets with stickers where they can assemble like a little village. So they're Christmas crafts. And she said, if you're interested in these, I'll just throw a bunch in a bag. So let's see how many I got in my bag. She even let me say which ones that I liked. So I said, well, give me three different ones of these. That way, um, for gifts, they, uh, if they were going to like a set of friends or siblings, they'd all have different ones. So $30 Canadian. So I got the Christmas train, the winter carousel, and the Santa's workshop. So those are the bigger ones. And then the smaller ones, which is what I had said I would like because my daughter's birthday was before Christmas and these would be a great loot bag item or a game for that Christmas store. So we have one holiday camper, two fire truck, three Ferris, or Ferris wheel, four penguin chalet, five, six, seven, eight, mermaid house. These ones are fifteen dollars each. Nine, ten, eleven. So, eleven foam gift sets that are fifteen dollars, and the thirty dollar ones we have three of those. And one fun little, I think my daughter will get this now. Play Doh set. <laughs> awesome. That is like, yeah, cute. Regular price. Seven dollars. So that is a kid's bag. All right. Now let's move on to this one. This is another good mixed grab bag of things. The cute cactus mermaid panda shaker stickers that were five dollars. They seem to have a lot of these four dollar bows. Pen tinsel. <laughs> okay. I have to count these bows at the end too. 
I'll have to count everything and then I'll list it in below in the description. I'll say, I got 20 packs of this tinsel or <laughs> however many bows because there's another pack of the tinsel. Two more of these ornaments. Okay. Talking about ornaments. I spy these in this bag and it was actually part of the reason why I picked this bag. <laughs> it's a little glass Vespa. Like, come on now. Sparkly, glittery, all blinged up. Actually barely even looks Christmassy. In fact, it's not. It's got butterflies on the side. No, I'm the, the, you know what? On this side, it's snowflakes, but it kind of could pass for um, flowers. And it actually might even be flowers, because that doesn't really look like snowflakes, so... This could be a cute little decoration or ornament, non Christmassy. A stove. <laughs> okay. <laughs> $16 for this one. How much is the Vespa? Uh, 10 I'm not sure why you'd want a green glass Christmas ornament that's a stove. I seem to have a set of these. <laughs> this one needs a little repair. It actually looks like a simple fix. Again, another hot air balloon. That's three of those. And I also have a pair of these. Cute little cupcake trolley. Adorable. $16. like those. Some more sweater and snowman ornaments. And another basket. Okay, more Christmas baths. Ooh. Oh, yay. I'm, well, I was going to say yay. So that mini bead kit that I could not recognize what it was supposed to be making. <laughs> I don't even know what this is. The shapes are not really well thought out. It's some sort of an animal. It seems to have a face and some legs. But they're perler beads, and you can use them simply enough to make a different design of your choosing. These again are those stickers that have those sloths and flamingos. Oh, they're adorable. I just love them. That's great. Great for kids' crafts again. Another one of these. Oh, the La La Lama. Again, it's got the stickers and the cute paper. So I've told you the price of all these things already. These were eight dollars. These were five dollars. Okay, there's a whole lot of glitter in here. There is some more a sticker roll, and these were priced at five dollars. Forty-eight pieces. There's so much glitter in this. I don't want to take this out. I don't know where the glitter is coming from. Oh, I see where the glitter is coming from. It's more of these pine cones, but these ones are glittery pine cones with colors, and I'll leave those in the bag. Another breakable looking Christmas ornament with polka dots on it. How perfect is that? Okay. My girlfriend made me a Christmas ornament, and she put polka dot mailbox in stickers. This might have a uh, matching twin. So the other side with the bow has an X on it. Mailbox. I'm trying to think if I could use that X at all. I think it'll get covered up. Again, more silicone molds. So these ones are one we haven't seen yet. Christmas lights. Bells we have, wreaths we have. Did, did they ever think they would sell this much tinsel? <laughs> I don't know. Do they even put tinsel on trees anymore? What on earth is this? Oh, oh, neat. $40. Mega bow. Make a bow in seconds. It's a giant bow, as if you were to put it on a like a car, some big, huge Christmas gift. 
but it's red. You can paint any time of year. It looks like a pretty simple assembly. You just pull tie strings and it forms a bow. So it's just like zoop and out comes a bow and it was $40. <laughs> yeah, another pack of these stickers that were $5. Ooh, another pack of these shaker stickers. Yay. I don't want to take these out. They have too much sparkles on them. More llamas, more bows. Another sticker. Oh gosh. Oh, that's that. Okay. So, and there was another one of these that doesn't have glitter. But that one thing is glittering up this entire bag. Okay, that's it for the bags. And now on to the boxes. So, one box, actually, both boxes, I think are pretty strongly wrapping supplies, most likely wrapping paper. But let's see if there's any surprises in here. Comes in a nice storage box anyway. I'm gonna figure out how I'm gonna store all this stuff till next year. I have a lot of things in here. <laughs> well if I didn't have enough bows trying to stay in the frame of the camera here and open it up with you so you can see as I see. Yeah, it's literally an entire box of wrapping paper for $4. Oh, no, there's more. Oh, wow. One, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> ten bows. And more stickers. Another one of these llama books that I really like. And Sticker boxes and sticker boxes galore. This one's a different one we have, ooh, haven't seen yet. A Christmas tree. So it's like a roll of stickers that, uh, gosh, kids would love. Loop eggs, hello. <laughs> awesome. A peppermint one, peppermint, peppermint, and a little penguin one. I haven't seen that one, oh, cute. Santa and uh, Snowflake, Joy. There's one, two, three, four, five, six of those. Ooh, a couple more of these books. Of this little raccoon again. I'm glad I got another one of him. Game. Loop bags, a Christmas store. Shall we count the rolls of wrapping paper? $8 each for the wrapping paper, by the way. Silver and gold, red, so one, two, stars, three, reindeer, four, green, five, which is like a silver and gold, six, seven, pure gold, eight, pure silver, nine, reindeer, ten, eleven, this one's a different pattern, this is actually a Christmas one, because it says joy noel and has a christmas tree i've lost count <laughs> seven i think eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen sixteen seventeen eighteen nineteen twenty twenty rolls this one's polka dots actually has a rose gold and a true gold the 20 square feet, 1.8 meters squared, or 2.6 yards by 30 inches. Okay, so yeah, there's a lot of a lot of uh, wrapping paper here that aren't specifically Christmassy. So this Christmas tree is very Christmassy. This reindeer is Christmassy. Oh gosh, those are cute little angels. Gold angels. Christmassy. 
and then these joy ones are Christmassy. The other ones really are just like patterns of silver, gold, and some red. So that's good. Okay. Great. Well, let's move on. Now we have to get into this box. I just covered up with the 2,000 bows that I've got. <laughs> Look okay, at we've got those random envelopes. It's like, <laughs> my scissors. Okay, last one. Here, I'll stand up and I'll just open it for the camera. I think I see more tinsel. Good <laughs> thing, because I didn't have enough. So fun, you guys. It's like Christmas in January. Look at all this is all coming spilling out. Oh, seriously, with this tinsel. <laughs> one, <laughs> two. Another one of these, that's good. Yay to those. See a nice gold wrapping that's snowflakes. One. Polka dot nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I'm sorry, I know I'm way out of frame. Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Twenty-two rolls of those. I like so many bows. I'll count them all up and I'll post all the. Um, Bounce of everything. Three more boxes of stickers. Again, some killer loop bags coming up next Christmas or Christmas store. Okay, so that's everything. That was a lot of stuff, and now I've got to figure out where to organize it all. <laughs> Anyways, thanks so much for watching. I always appreciate you guys. I've been getting a really great number of people all of a sudden finding my channel and so much interaction and comments. So thank you so much. If you like my videos, please subscribe and uh, hit the notification bell so you receive a notification every time I post a new video. So I appreciate you guys here. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again next time.